computer and network security has become critical for most organizations, especially in recent years, with hackers becoming more numerous and more adept at stealing and altering private information. A comprehensive security system protects an organization's resources, including information, computer, and network equipment. The information an organization needs to protect can take on many forms, emails, invoices transferred via electronic data interchanges or EDIs, new product designs, marketing campaigns, and or financial statements. Security threats involve more than stealing data. They include actions such as sharing passwords with coworkers, leaving a computer unattended while logged onto the network, or even spilling coffee on a keyboard. A comprehensive security system includes hardware, software, procedures, and personnel that collectively protect information resources and keep intruders and hackers at bay. There are three important aspects of computer and network security, confidentiality, integrity, and availability, collectively referred to as the CIA triangle. Confidentiality means that a system must not allow the disclosing of information by anyone who is not authorized to access it. Integrity refers to the accuracy of information resources within the organization. Availability means that computers and networks are operating and authorized users can access the information they need. A comprehensive security system must provide three levels of security. Level 1 for front-end servers, Level 2 for back-end systems, and Level 3 for the corporate network being protected against intrusion, denial of service attacks, and unauthorized access. When planning a comprehensive security system, the first step is designing fault-tolerance systems, which use a combination of hardware and software for improving reliability, a way of ensuring availability in case of system failure. A backup power unit continues to provide electrical power in the event of blackouts and other power interruptions and is most often used to protect servers. A redundant array of independent disks is known as a RAD system. It's a collection of disk drives used to store data in multiple places. RAD systems also store a value called checksum, used to verify that data has been stored or transmitted without error. Mirror disks is a method used when two disks containing the same data are used. If one fails, the other is available, allowing operations to continue. Mirror disks are generally a less expensive solution, 